While people near the Gulf Coast prepare for a tropical storm, Nicholas, the Capaya County Sheriff's Office is helping those who are still recovering from Hurricane Ida. 12 News' Leah Williams has the details about the department's donation drive. The Capaya County Sheriff's Office is trying to fill this trailer with supplies by the end of the week. Sheriff Byron Swilly says he's grateful that Ida didn't cause too much damage in Capaya County, so he wants to give back. Been keeping them uh, also in our prayers uh, in that area, but we thankful and just wanted to reach out to them to to lend a, a helping hand. The sheriff says his office reached out to law enforcement in several different parishes to offer supplies. In Jefferson Parish, which is the New Orleans area, law enforcement said people there could really use the help. Now Sheriff Swilly is asking everyone to donate supplies like non-perishable foods, paper products, clothing, diapers, and other toiletries. It's my first time being uh, a participant uh, in something like this, but I'm very excited just to be able to help. And that's what a community about. And I'm asking everyone from uh, our community, the Kapai County area, and any other surrounding areas that um, uh, want to help, um, you know, asking them to also just lend the hand in. The sheriff says getting these items out to people in need is important, especially with Tropical Storm Nicholas possibly hitting parts of Louisiana this week. So deputies will be hauling the supplies to Louisiana themselves. We will contact the uh, um, them in, in that area, Jefferson Parish, and see when would be a good time for us to coordinate to, to travel their way. The department just started accepting donations this morning, and some families have already stopped by to donate. Items can be dropped off at the Capaya County Sheriff's Office, Hazelhurst City Hall, and Crystal Springs City Hall until 4 p.m. Friday. In Capaya County, Leah Williams, 12 News.